<laughs> Yo, you guys, what is going on? It's Blazing Your Kicks here, and today in this video, we're going to be filming the sneakerhead, like, back to school, what you should have, what you should make sure you utilize if you're a sneakerhead, I don't know. I figured I'd make this video because about 30% of you are in school already, and the 70% of the United States is still not in school. So, I mean, this is for both parties. If you're in school, we'll go somewhere and pick all this stuff up. If you're not in school yet, convince your parents to give you back to school money and uh, use some of my tips. We're actually not going to be doing a vlog style video today. We're going to be doing a sit down, which I haven't done in a while. So shout out to all the OGs who remember the sit down videos. And let's get on the tripod. Boom. All right, you guys, we are back. And uh, let's just get the thumbnail right now. Ready? Bang, that's the thumbnail. All right, guys, so here we go. These are the things you need as a sneakerhead in order to survive school. Well, you All right, you guys, so we're going to start off with the t-shirts, some of the t-shirts that you need. Not, not that you need, but some of the t-shirts that I prefer and this type of style of shirts that I wear. So this first one right here is a limited edition Blazendary pink IBM tee. You can check it out on the blazingarykicks.ticktail.com website. That is, uh, these are limited quantities and I'll be at Sneaker Games Orlando September 4th. So I'll have some extra quantity. Come pick up one in person, cash, I'll sign it. Whatever you guys want, I'll be there. Next one is a sold out Blazendary Patagonia tee that is going to be re-releasing eventually. And this one is the original CL t-shirt right here. This was the first of its kind. Uh, also sold out, but we'll restock. And, and I guess really what I'm trying to say is, that, that was just a plug for my website, you know, to help afford my car payment. These tees are the ones I recommend the most. Go to Walmart or H&M, get yourself a pack of plain white and black comfort blend t-shirts. These are the best, they match the nicest. They're pretty comfortable. Simple logo stuff, like simple patterns, nothing too outrageous, no crazy design, anything like that. That's just how I dress, that's my style. Not saying it's right or wrong, but you're watching my video, so this is my opinion. Next up, these are the shorts I'm gonna be bringing out. So right here, these are the H&M shorts, they're 17 bucks. You can go to H&M, get yourself some $12 shirts, $17 shorts. Here in North Carolina, it's like 98 degrees outside, so we're still wearing shorts here. I'm wearing shorts right now. But uh, I'm really not a big fan of wearing basketball shorts and stuff like that, like Nike basketball shorts. Uh, rare occasions, like if I'm gonna go to the gym or something like that. But these right here, definitely simple and lifestyle efficient. That's even a thing. And right here, these are actually the jeans that uh, I'm gonna be wearing to school eventually. It's a little hot for jeans, but even though I've worn them two days in a row already. But these are just some H&M jeans and I'll actually have a full jeans collection video uh, coming soon in the fall. I'm not really highlighting too much on the jeans. Just uh, h and is a good spot for them. For more clothes, you gotta have some more essentials, like the all-white Nike high-top socks, and of course the no-show Nike socks. Uh, these are good for when you pinroll your jeans that you don't wanna see your socks, and those are good if you're wearing jeans. Another type of sock I really like to wear are the ones that Stradline Socks makes. So these right here, well first off, Stradline Socks are super comfortable. I think they're more comfortable than Nikes, but I had to give a plug to the homies over at Nike. But the homies over at Stradline, they sent me these awesome socks right here. I got them before they released. These are the Stradline Pocket Socks. You literally can put stuff in these. They're great when you're wearing jeans, like say you got a house key, money, lunch money, you don't want that bully. Well if there's a bully, you can go up to him and punch him right in the damn face. That's if he's giving you a problem first. Don't start the fight, end it. Whatever you got in there, pocket socks, man, Stradline socks, they also got other designs. Uh, these are, in fact, my favorite socks that I own. And lastly, you know, all them girls. Okay, class, can you turn to page two, please? And can somebody answer the following question? Um, Yeezy 3 plus Yeezy 1 equals ooh, what? Ooh, the answer is Yeezy 4. Are those 2016 Spring Summer Collection Supreme Boxers? <laughs> Moving along, you guys, next up, these are some just like last clothing items, I guess. Go out, if you're gonna wear like shorts and you're gonna tuck your shirt in or something, get yourself a classy looking belt. Uh, these right here I picked up from Good Friends, so I guess, I mean, I wouldn't really recommend going to Louis Vuitton and buying a $400 belt. If you can afford it, definitely do it. If not, find a good one on eBay, a real one, obviously. Yeah, definitely recommend these. All right, now these are like the accessories, the shoes, the stuff you should you know really have so right here of course I got my wallet this is also Louis Vuitton wallet I got it from a friend it is super beat but if you can you know them ladies love those that Louis Vuitton moving along if you drive you should definitely invest in a supreme lanyard of any kind these are my beamer keys right here keep that in my jeans it's all good next up just some more things I think you guys should have if you guys like headphones definitely get yourself a headphones case and these are just my beats in here I got them from the Apple store, they're only like a hundred bucks. And then uh, the case is like $7 on eBay. Next up, if you're one of those people that uses their phones a lot, I highly recommend getting a power bank of any kind. This one is a Kith power bank and it's super awesome. 
but uh, it's a little over my pretty much over anyone's budget for a thing so go to like stop and shop harris teeter amp whatever grocery store you guys have go over buy yourself like a 30 dollar charger run out of battery laundering school that can solve your problems come along if you got a girlfriend man don't don't forget your chapstick that one day in school It'd be bad news and uh, so these are like some more accessories you guys can wear so, so right here's my live low kai bracelet and then i also got my rope chain on and if they let you wear hats in school you know hats those are nice too. So for watches, these are my two recommendations. If you're going for like a business class like dressed up look, get yourself something like this. This is uh, a Volvo, it was like 500 bucks. And then this is an Apple Watch. Uh, anything like a G-Shock, Apple Watch, something like that. You know, it's not a bad accessory to have. And uh, when you're going classy that one day, it's not bad to have a dressy type watch either. So this is an essential. This right here is a Supreme water bottle. You gotta stay hydrated, folks. You never know what's gonna happen that night, that morning, that afternoon. Just stay hydrated. Right here, this is an essential if you're a sneakerhead. 1,000% recommend this to keep this in your backpack. Let's say that one kid at lunch freaking does this. Boo! He needs some milk! My shoes! Ah! Crap! You got my back? You don't even have to worry about something like that if you already sprayed them down beforehand. Ooh. And if you want to wear Jordans and stuff like that, sneaker shields. Highly recommend sneaker shields because you put them in your shoes. You're walking around like, goddamn, I don't have to walk around like a duck because my shoes aren't going to get creased with these in. We're great. I have a promo code. Use the code BLAZONARY along with the code for Stradline. Use Last accessory pieces. This is just my backpack. This is a Supreme Courier backpack from last year. I definitely recommend it. Uh, and I recommend the Courier one the most because... It can fit the most things like it opens up so you can like put your binders in it and then like your pencil pouch and like a book for something on top of it like I actually have in here right now. And another tip you guys for like so like I got shoes left to talk about but don't be this kid who wears things like this to school. Sup ladies? All right, and these are the shoes that I recommend the most that you guys probably could have seen the whole video but I'm um, you got to you got to let me talk about them. Right, these are my black Gucci slides. Definitely a huge recommendation for anybody trying to make some moves on the ladies. We got the white ones, you know, same power moves, guys, power moves. You can afford it. Not everyone can afford everything in this video, but I highly recommend getting 350s. And for the, I mean, this is kind of useless because those who wanted 350s can have them. Right here, these are the black Ultra Boost, the white Ultra Boost. These are the 1.0. These are the 2.0. Uh, like right here, a good fit would be the white Ultra Boost jeans and then a black t-shirt and if you're gonna wear the black ultra boost black ultra boost jeans and a white i always mix match like i always wear a white t-shirt with black shoes black t-shirt with white shoes that's just how i roll the two colors don't look good stacked on top of each other in my opinion raining that one day fam you gotta have a backup pair of shoes uh keep them in your car i don't know if you drive to school or if it's just raining in general like right here i already freaking like trashed these already but i don't care they're vans same with these they're vans lastly shout out to my ex for the one time if you got a girlfriend in school it's always cute to match your sneakers. So buy a GR. Yeah, I know, I went. I mean, these weren't a shelf sitter, but they're, they're GR. I don't really wear GRs. This is pretty damn cute. Not gonna lie. I mean, it's not cute anymore, because I'm, I'm just... No, she didn't, She gave them back to me. I didn't ask for them back. But Anyways, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, please make sure you smash that like button. A lot of people may disagree with what I have to say. A lot of people may agree. All I'm saying is simplicity is key. I definitely recommend it everything in this video this is all stuff i've owned and collected you know over the past year two years aside from that if you're brand new please make sure you smash that like button if you're brand new also subscribe and if you're existing or brand new leave a comment down below i appreciate every 65,000 one of you i know i don't say it enough but i really do appreciate it and i don't want to keep saying it over and over and get boring that's all i have for you blazing your kicks i'm out peace By the way, I didn't really mention this in the video, but this is really more of a summer. Like, this is for summer, the end of summer, because, you know, you go back to school, the end of summer. I'll probably make a fall one. Like, I didn't show any jackets. I didn't show many pants. I didn't really show any of that because it's summer.